What I hate is looking up and seeing chemtrails in a clear blue sky today. Um, there are four songs that I want to ask you about, and I did what I have never done before, which is to actually print these lyrics out. Some of them, I'm, 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 since the record is so new, I'm learning some of them. I got, got some of them memorized. Um, who, it, who gave you the lyrics, though? I've seen some really strange rewrites of my yeah. stuff. Well, I've I'm, seen one time they uh, said uh, the lyrics to When Doves Cry was, uh, dig, if you will, the picture of me, Marvin Gaye, and the kids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you and know there, what? And then there was another one. <laughs> This person will go unnamed. Yes. Uh, she didn't speak the English language too good. Right. Uh, she had a really cute daughter, so that's why we was acquaintances. Yeah. <laughs> but she swore up and down, <laughs> little red Corvette was pay the rent, collect. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know what? <laughs> so you need to let me check that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, uh, I'm a fast learner. So I'm not going to read none of these on the air. I'm just going to ask you about the songs okay. and about the lyrical content. And uh, for those who don't have the record, you can go to lotusflower.com and get it and, and follow along at home. Uh, even if you're two or three days late, you can play this back and follow along. In no particular order, since we mentioned Dreamer first, tell me about Dreamer. Oh, well, um, when I saw the uh, State of the Black Union, Dick Gregory uh, really moved me and a lot of my friends, I show it to everybody that comes over the house, especially white folks, because they need to hear that, you know, so that they know more about all of us. Mm -hmm. Because um, what he said affects all of us. He said something that really hit home about um, this phenomena of chemtrails. And, you know, when I was a kid, I used to see these trails in the sky all the time. And I said, oh, that's cool. A jet just went over. And then you started to see a whole bunch of them. And next thing you know, everybody in your neighborhood was fighting and arguing, and you didn't know why. OK? And, and you really didn't know why. I mean, everybody was fighting. So he, he started riffing about the chemtrails. And he started to say things that uh, hit home so hard. And I would recommend that everybody try to get what he said online or wherever and try to get a copy of it and just listen to it. Mm -hmm. Because the, uh, I was so moved that I had to write the song. And then when you leave, when you leave, <laughs> with all the hassle, can you have that love? love? I'm so tired of you black folk walking around looking all evil like that's going to change something. <laughs> looking all mean and talking all crazy. Let them tell you about your children. If I sit here today and these are all white folks and they're putting some sleeping pill in my water and I sit up here and doze off and go to sleep and everybody told in the world, Niggas is lazy. <laughs> they tired. No, that's because you too naive enough to know what they putting in my water. Okay? Your children ain't violent because they black. They ain't violent. Most people in the world live in a ghetto. They don't kill people. What are you putting in my malt liquor, white boy? What are you putting in? Huh? Hear me. Malt liquor is made by white companies, but only sold in black neighborhoods, and you ain't checked it to see what's in it. Huh? How much lead are you putting in my neighborhood? Lead affects my thinking capacity. Lead, there's only one thing on the planet more dangerous than lead, and that's manganese. Manganese will make you kill your mama. And let me tell y'all something. If you want to see the largest homicide rate in the world, it ain't in no black ghetto in America. It's a little town in Australia where them white folks' homicide rate is 200 times what their population is. 
And that town just happened to be located across the street from a manganese plant. Big up of a hell. Right, right here, right here. Sit, sit back down, that, Dick. Don't lose that mic. Yeah. That, that town is located across the street from a manganese plant. How much manganese are you spraying in my neighborhood at night while I'm sleeping? How in the world can a nine-year-old child find a heron man, but the FBI can't find it, and you gonna tell me that's a black thing? Y'all crazy? What is this about? These are the things that need to change while this brother and sister's on their way to the White House. And when you see Hillary, and y'all see Brother Barack, Thank him for me, and you white folks need to be thankful, because if y'all had a brother like me, y'all would really be in trouble. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Okay? Ladies and gentlemen, Dick Gregory. Dick Gregory. I was so moved that I had to write the song. The other thing is the first line of the song says I was born uh, on the same plantation in the United States of the red, white, and blue. And we live in a place now that feels just about like a plantation. We're all indentured servants, you know. Um, when I found out there were eight presidents before George Washington, I wanted to smack somebody. Mm -hmm. You know, I wanted to know why I was taught otherwise. Just tell me the whole story. I'll fill in the blanks. But don't, you know, don't tell me something that you think I'm supposed to know. What I hate is looking up and seeing chemtrails in a clear blue sky today.